Grand Rapids could soon have a new heart of the city. Today, 616 Lofts and Lokes Theaters, which own Celebration Cinemas, announced their proposal to add a movie theater with joining apartments and retail behind Van Andel Arena. 24-Hour News 8's Heather Walker is live downtown at that location with what the proposed plan means for downtown. Well, Sue, if the developers have their way, then the movie complex will sit here on these two parking lots across the street from one another. We're on the corner of Oaks and Ionia, and you can see this uh, street here that leads to 131. Well, under this plan, that stretch of road will be eliminated. There are a lot of challenges uh, to get people to come downtown for something that you can get in the suburbs, too. We think we've got some really great solutions for those challenges. The president of Lokes Theaters, J.D. Lokes, who owns local Celebration Cinemas, is the man behind the plan. He's been working on getting a movie theater downtown for the past four years. Over the summer, he brought in 616 Lofts as a partner. We're really grateful to be part of this transformative project and look forward to look forward to bringing it to this city. The $140 million project hopes to have a nine screen theater, a piazza with an outdoor screen, more than 350 apartments, 40,000 square feet of retail, and a parking ramp with close to 1,000 spaces. The theater will be anchoring the piazza here. It's a new concept for Grand Rapids with elevators and bridges connecting the apartments to the movie theater and retail. Loke says if the project is approved, it won't be your typical movie theater. He hopes to show sports games, television shows, outdoor shows, even live performances. He says he's also looking at innovations for seating and refreshments. It'll continue to evolve a little bit over the course of the next year, but what you're seeing today is really essentially the, the structure and layout. This is not a done deal. It will still have to be approved by the downtown authority, de development authority. That's the next step. But if it is approved, construction could start next year and the movie theater could be built by 2019. Live in downtown Grand Rapids tonight, Heather Walker, 24-hour News 8.